kitchen cleanliness is really important. Your kitchen cloth gets used to wipe everything down. And as a rule of thumb, I'm doing this every single week to, to just liven it up, but also to kill the germs in the cloth that we kind of run around all over our bench and we just don't realize how, how yucky it is. How you can tell if it's really, really needing a clean is it's very sort of goopy when you squeeze it and also it's smelly. So let me show you how to give it a beautiful zhuzh and it only takes a few minutes but you've got to use nice hot water, you use your beautiful ginola and you just give it a bit of love. Watch this. A really good lug of ginola because you need to kill that bacteria. Just freshly boiled jug of water and then what you're going to do is just place your yucky cloth into the water and you're going to also put your little wee dishwasher mop in there as well. Just leave it in there and you watch it will go from not so pretty to the most prettiest little colour in the world and you're recycling and, and reusing something that's already a perfectly good cloth that just needs a bit of a clean up. So just leave that to soak for a bit and it'll come right. So we've pretty much soaked that for, oh goodness, 30 minutes maybe, maybe less and Look at how gorgeous it looks now. It's all yellow, fresh. Give it a good squeeze. Ginola is a bleach, and so at the end of the day, you do need gloves on to actually squeeze all the ginola out of the cloth. Don't handle ginola with your hands because you'll never get the smell out. It's just definitely squeeze it with your gloves on. Look how beautiful that looks. Lovely and clean and gorgeous. And then the little utensils had a good little clean. So now you've got beautiful clean utensils to use for the rest of the week. And you've just kind of saved yourself money because you don't have to go and buy a new one. All good to go.